Yo, 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 what's poppin' y'all? Jay Sancy back in this thing. Today, I'm bringing you a quick video on the Bullfrog. I'm gonna show you the best attachments and perks that you can use in league play, so let's get right to it after the intro. And I ain't never had it all, had a couple falls. Wanna walk the walk, but now I'm learning how to crawl. Really wanna flex, but now I'm learning how to ball. Really wanna, now I'm learning how to... All right, y'all, so this video is really gonna be about the weapon, but before we do that, let's just get the perks out of the way really quickly. I'm running Perk Greed, so I have six perks instead of three. On the first slot, I have Flak Jacket and Attack Mask, so no grenades are gonna hurt me. On the second slot, I have Assassin and Quartermaster. Assassin, so that I get bonus points for my score streaks because they're very crucial in this game mode. And Quartermaster, because I like recharging my grenades every 25 seconds. In the third slot, you want Ninja, and you can use either Spycraft or Cold Blooded. Cold Blooded will hide you from airstrikes and things like that but I like Spycraft so I can hack trophy systems and it's very helpful in hardpoint and control. Now let's get to the weapon. The first attachment you want is the Spetsnaz Compensator to make the vertical recoil control a lot better. Secondly, you want the 8.1 inch Liberator Barrel. This is gonna double your bullet velocity. It's very important to make this weapon good at medium to longer range engagements. Next in the underbarrel category, you want the Spetsnaz Grip to lower your vertical recoil and your horizontal recoil. This is really important. This makes this weapon a complete laser with pretty much no recoil at all. In your handle section, of course, you want the Gru Elastic Wrap. That's on every SMG, no matter what. And you want to run the KGB stock. It's going to help you with that sprint to fire time. And it's nice when you're ADS, you can walk a little bit quicker. All right, y'all. So as you can see in the clips behind me now, this weapon is very, very good. I think it's the best medium range SMG. It's good at long range. However, the bullet velocity is a little low. So you will notice a tiny, tiny bit of bullet drop and delay. However, this and the AK are definitely my two favorite SMGs. On some days I use this over the AK and other days I might use the AK. As always, I like to keep these videos short to get you right back out there on the battle field if this video did help you please drop a like and subscribe i post one call of duty video every day thank you and until next time peace